walking this guy and he's been working on it. And uh, he mentioned he, um, he's already worked on the two, what I would call the two sound walking step. Just this. So if you have this, everybody do this just to get back into it. exactly how to do it and exactly how high to lift your arm. And, you know, they're basically, you know, the step in the back jug, whatever you call it. Um, you can do it any way you want, but there are two basic um, styles of doing it. Um, at least if you're doing these big back jugs. And that is to do it basically with a straight feet or picking up from the head. Those are two different interpretations of the walking step. Do the movement sequentially. Do them in a sequence. 
is don't feel that, oh, I need to make a flow, so I need to combine them so one starts before the other finishes so that it flows. No, 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 don't do that. Do that for one and after the other, kind of like the silver ball. It's like you have that rack of silver balls, the one on the end doesn't go, oh, this one's coming in, I'm going to move. It waits to be hit, right? It does that. It doesn't go, oh, I'm getting out of the way before it hits. Do it in absolute sequence. And if you're relaxed and bring it into it, it will flow. But if you start combining the moves,